Hi, this video is about the Caribou Mathematics Contest in Canada. I'm going to show the solution for the January 2012 Grade 5-6 Contest Question 15, which also came up in the Grade 7-8 Contest. So the question is, there are 8 jars of strawberry jam, 7 jars of raspberry jam, and 5 jars of cherry jam on a high shelf. You can just reach the jam, but cannot see the jar until you bring it down. How many jars can you take off the shelf to be sure that there are at least four jars of one type and at least three jars of an another type left on the shelf? So in this table, S stands for strawberry, R stands for raspberry, and C stands for cherry. And these numbers are from the problem. So there are eight jars with strawberry jam, seven jars with raspberry jam, and five jars with cherry jam. So the method for solving this problem is to look at the worst case possible, which is the maximum number of jars left on the shelf so that at least one of the requirements is not satisfied. So let's look at the first case, which is a failure. And that would be having not four of one type of jam. So if we know that we cannot have four, four jars of jam in any type, so that means that we would have to have the maximum number so that the requirement is not satisfied. It would have to be one less than four for each type of jam. And that would be three, three, and three. So the total of that would be 9. So for up here, we have the total number of jars, which are strawberry, which is 8, and then the total number of jars which for raspberry, which is 7, and the total number of jars for cherry, which is 5. So we would have to add them up. So that would be 8 plus 7 plus 5 is 20. So the total number of jars on the shelf are 20. So let's look at the second case, which is also still a failure. And that would be having at least four of one type of jam. but then not having three or more of another type of jam. So if we know that for one type of jam there can be there are at least four or more, then for the maximum number we would have to pick the biggest number out of those three, which is eight. So we would have eight. And then for the second requirement, which we cannot satisfy because we already satisfied the first requirement, it is not like at least three of a different type of jam. So that means we would have, for the maximum number, 
it would be one less than three for the last two jams. So that would be two and two. So now the total of 8 plus 2 plus 2 is 12. So now we would pick the bigger number out of these two cases, which is 12. So if we know the maximum number of jars left on the shelf, which is still false, is 12. So that means we know that one more jar, that would be 13. So then we know that that would be correct. So we, we have 20 minus then 13 is 7. So the, most, the biggest number of jars that you can take off the shelf is 7. So the answer is at most 7. If you'd like to know more about this contest, please feel free to visit our website at www.brocky.ca slash caribou.